All right, guys. Morning. You guys enjoyed the video last night? No. Surprised I didn't edit it yet. And I'll show you. It's the morning. It's unlocking itself. This is what happens when you're a in the middle of the night. You end up filling up <laughs> the entire trunk of your SUV you just bought, so you had more room to throw some stuff. Hell, I even think there's some more stuff up there. But I think we're gonna head up some thrift stores today, probably. Probably no more retail arbitrage. Oh, well, of course we're gonna stop somewhere along the way. Sometimes it's too hard not to. And we'll make another 50 video for you guys today. Hope you enjoyed. Alright. Now we're finally out and about. Gotta jump off an eBay package. As you can see, can't show up at the post office on time. Even though it's Saturday, super long. That's usually the line looks like. Mail's not too bad. Sale is the day. You can see we're very busy. Yeah, Coast Guard get 50% off. We didn't bring a postcard. Let's see if that PS2 is still here. PS2 is gone. So I must have enjoyed their new PS2. Hey, there's the road. Probably watch that movie. Never seen it. All those BSC games are still there. Samsung. Just a clip away camera. Nothing else. Let's see. Well, looks like that DVD player's gone too. There's a guy I remember seeing. Composition. He's just sitting down. Probably waiting for his wife to get done shopping. The normal barrage of cheap speakers they have. The yellow keyboard. And there's that guitar. As you can see, it's not really the greatest to go to Goodwill that you already been there, but this is right by that post office. We thought we'd just pop in and see what they had. Here is a five and one stand up deluxe casino. Dollar fifty. I'm sure it's probably worth a dollar fifty. The question is, is it worth more or around ten? Probably not. We'll look it up. There's a new inbox, better than Venus. Mars, one of those things. Didn't buy a thing in there. That little stand up thing, there is a lot of auctions for sale. And uh, it was a little beat up. All right, Salvation Army time. We're not big fans of Salvation Army. I haven't really found a lot of stuff here. This is usually the same old stuff that's been here for a couple months now. Plus this store that's right here off of that highway. They close early and they'll sit there and stare at you from the window even though it's like 45 minutes to close or an hour and not let you in, which is like a weird type of thing to do. This one's 50% off all the yellow tag items. Like, let's see if they have the UPC. Yeah, they got Maybe with the golf clubs. Oh, yeah, I'm pretty sure it's just a mannequin. There's a set of DVDs. A jewel crown. All there. Look at that. Clean away the water conditioner. You know, it's a couple of guitars. Shark attack. Left the sharks in there. Goodwill. Picked up this little Roswell uh, wireless and adapter. Won three bucks for it. There was one seller, I don't know if it was FBA or not, on PC for like $29.99. I'm not sure they had a hand of the retail Goodwills because usually their prices are the same as retail, obviously. I think a lot of them up here across the border are usually about that. This thing. You do find stuff, weird stuff like this. I guess you just gotta scan. Anybody else remember these things? HD DVDs? This will have about 20 or 30 of them. 
and a couple of the players. I think the players are still worth a little bit of money. All right, and there's the uh, sacks of boom. Sacks, what is that? Sacks of boom on the bottom shelf. Anywhere from 40 to 60. Three, nine to nine. And I just got out of that Goodwill. Uh, as you can see, that saxophone. What the hell is that? What is that? Tech timer. Teach timer. It's like a little $20 timer. Teach timer. Everything was half off. There's a four dollar uh, Panasonic CD player with the cable. There was that saxophone thing. Let me see some. Uh, there's the Barney phone. It's like two bucks. One sold like sixteenth, sixteenth uh, of this month for like twenty five bucks. I don't know if it works or not. It takes batteries. Then there was a lens sitting down there. It was nine ninety nine half off. I took up. I looked it up, and it's like an eighty dollar lens, and I can't. I guess the only reason why I think it wouldn't be in there is if there's something wrong with it. I don't know if we have any way of testing it. And uh, there was this phone here too. I don't know if it's, they say it's new, but this one wasn't half off. But on, if it was new on Amazon, that goes for the, you get like 280 bucks back after fees. It's obviously been open before, so I have to open it and make sure it's new. But if not, we could still sell it used and make a pretty big profit on that. But now we're going into the Walmart. Here's a small little flea market thing. It's just across the street from Goodwill. It's pretty big. We got a lot of like booze and stuff in here. But this one here's a pro. Just uh, throw it all on the table. They had a Weight Watcher scale in there for $3.99. Basically brand new in box. Has all the instructions and everything. You can probably get like 30, 40 bucks out of it. And there was a, a fat PS2 that had two memory cards, two controller extensions, the cords and two of uh, these clear, um, I believe it's called Ocean Blue PS2 controllers. Cleanest fat PS2 I've ever seen. So I'm gonna pull it out of there. As you can see, it's, it's a little blurry because I'm a little close, but just like minimal dust. You can tell it wasn't really clean before either. Minimal dust there in the back. And all that stuff was $14.99. $29? All right, stopped at another Walmart right after that thrift store. Had one of the big clearances and they got like Three, four aisles all over the hour over there. I did end up getting a cart full. Those Legos are only 15 bucks. It's like $40 Legos or more. So not good stuff. All right, remember when I said we're not gonna do RA this time? I like the car. I said we're sticking to our, not gonna do RA. I lied, apparently somebody's revving up the car. <laughs> 